What is up, everybody? It is your boy Everything TV, and so I'm coming at you with a. I need. I need to get a sound effect. Somebody help me out. I do a tsh, tsh, like sound effect when I go. It's your boy Everything tsh, tsh, TV, and so I'm coming at you with another banging video. But that requires editing. All these videos are raw, guys. I need an editor. If anybody wants to be my editor, so where I could send these videos to you, please get with me. I'll leave my email in the description. I'll pay you guys to edit my videos. I suck at editing. I do not want to edit my videos. Uh, if it's easier to do like that, then I'm all for it, guys. I need an editor. Let's put that out there. I need an editor. All right, guys. So today, we are still hunting for that elusive shiny Charizard. We have pulled them once, but we want to do it twice. Also, we're going to be hunting for the Burning Shadows. Burning Shadows. And we're going to hunt for something that's not a Charizard, but I haven't pulled before. The Mew and Mewtwo Secret Rare, Rainbow Rare, Mew and Mewtwo. Rainbow rare, hyper rare, whatever you want to call it. We're still searching for that. Guys, if you're new to the channel, please make sure you're hitting that like button and subscribing to the channel. We do post content daily. We stream as well. We do a whole bunch of crazy things on this channel. Hence the name, Everything TV Ansem, guys. So, without further ado, let's get right into this set. Let's go ahead and pop some packs. I just love cracking some packs, guys. See, like if I had an editor, that would have been edited to be edited so let's get into some packs guys we are still hunting for that rainbow rare mewtwo i didn't open up uh that much unified minds i just i, I think i opened up <coughs> excuse me a uh a uh a whatchamacallit the um uh freaking things i can never get the name the uh elite trainer boxes i think that's all i opened up was elite trainer boxes and that was it and maybe a couple of loose packs but we didn't open up much of the uh cosmic eclipse i just didn't find it a very entertaining set but you know throughout time i learned to appreciate it and now i want to get that rainbow rare mewtwo it's actually a very sick card a card that's probably selling for about close to a hundred dollars so we'll try to get it from a dollar tree pack i don't want to invest too much into it but if i end up having to then i will probably buy a booster box or two or three or four or five just to get that card because i am persistent i think there's a couple other good cards in this set as well but what we're after is that Rainbow Rare Mew and Mewtwo. We did buy a whole box, $100 tree packs from the dollar store. And so far, the only good card we got was a uh, Misty's, I think, uh, Misty's Favor Full Art. So that's what we got, a Misty's Favor Full Art. Haven't pulled anything else. I don't think we had a whole bunch of hollow hits. I don't know the ratio for these dollar tree packs, but um, we haven't pulled anything uh anything really these are how many uh packs we have i think we've already cracked open like five or six but uh we didn't pull any anything that was super fuego except the full art the full art was nice i actually did that live with my buddies uh dj and premiere pulls we ended up pulling that on a uh just on a little call hunch curl the bird that crows for the hunches the hunch that crows for the munches. So I'm I'm try, I'm hunting three things essentially to uh, hopefully you know have a better pull rate chance to get something that's really really good because we do want to get you know that shiny Charizard and that Rainbow Rare Charizard again. That would be ideal for us to get those cards again. Um, you know everybody's hunting those Zards and um, we are too. You know it's something that I really love doing. Very very expensive. I recommend if you don't have a Pokemon problem, don't get into one. Cause it's actually, it's actually a thing, man. Um, but it's a good thing. It's a fun thing. It brings people together. You meet beautiful new people. You get to open up some packs and test your luck. And uh, I enjoy it a lot. You know, I met a lot of great people. Premier pools. You know, uh, DJ. We met. A, I met a lot of good people through Pokemon. And I want to keep keep bringing. And I've gotten a lot of people that didn't think they liked Pokemon or were into Pokemon back into Pokemon through the community. Reverse hollow. So yeah, these Dollar Tree packs are not paying off. Damn it. I want my dollars back. I want all my dollars back. Ooh, I think I seen something, but I'm not too sure. It might have just been my eyes playing mind tricks. A Pokey Mirage, guys. That is actually a thing. A Pokey Mirage. We only got four, five, six, seven packs left. Yeah, I think, oh, actually, I got a, I think I got a, I think I got a um a dark cry and umbreon actually I think I did oh jolt ticks yeah you're not guaranteed to get anything from these packs 
uh, but you never know, you know, you could get a rainbow rare. I haven't pulled a rainbow rare from a Dollar Tree pack. I think the last rainbow rare I pulled was an Incineroar, and that was from like Fates Collides or something like that. I'm not too sure. Ooh, the little clay animation or little whatever, that puppet knitted shirt, t-shirt looking thing, whatever that is. But yeah, you know, you're not guaranteed to get anything from Dollar Tree packs. You, you do get them sometimes, but you know, that's, that's, that's just Pokemon. It's always a gamble. Um, but it's a fun gamble. But yet, alone, it's still a gamble. Ooh, straggly. We're not getting the hits out of the Dollar Tree packs. Jesus. Do the Dollar Tree packs really take my dollar? It's all fun and get love. You know, fun and game. You know, if anything, we just add these to our collection. Popplio Ultra Beast. Dang it. Didn't even get a holographic. That's that's the crazy thing. Well, we got two packs left of these Dollar Tree packs. After this pack, hopefully we will get on a fire streak. Merlin, Reverse Hollow. Yeah, we, we picked up a whole box. You guys can go to your local uh, dollar store and you'll see them. Normally, they're like one of those boxes or they're hanging up on the shelves. Always $1. Ooh, a Celebi holographic. I've never pulled this Celebi. I didn't even know this was in... Uh, I didn't even know that was in this set. That's actually really, really nice. Nice. We pulled the Celebi. It's actually really nice. I've never seen that Celebi in uh, that set before. So that, that's going to count up as a hit. Didn't even think that was a card in this Unified Mindset. But I'll take it. I'll take it. Very nice card. Very, very nice Celebi. 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 I didn't even know that was a card in this set. Tapu Fini non-holographic rare. And that was all of the Dollar Tree packs, ladies and gentlemen. We are out of the way of Dollar Tree packs. Big bulk stack. Didn't get nothing good. But uh, it's not about. It's a thrill of the hunt. And the hunt itself, guys. Now we're going to get into some Shadows of the Burning Shadows. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Burning Shadows pack, guys. Are we going to get a hit we um didn't do too well in yesterday's video i'm gonna try to upload uh these pokemon videos uh once every maybe maybe once or twice a week possibly just once i don't know yet but we're gonna try to do that at least once a week to for all the pokemon fans out there get the pokey blood flowing so here we go we got a psychic energy lana electric buzz simp more a loaning grimer sneasel charmander Crabrawler, Meowth, Acerola, and a Butterfree. I'm not going to lie to you guys as well. These hits have been horrible from Burning Shadows. I mean, they've been bad. They've been extremely bad in Burning Shadows. Like, I'm surprised on how bad these hits have been. Burning Shadows did me really good. I mean, the first... Burning Shadows is what got me back into Pokemon. Um, I, uh... I... Got that Charizard. I really wanted that Rainbow Rare Charizard. My friend Rise to Valor actually got me into Pokemon again. And he recommended for me to get uh, Burning Shadows. This is my first set. Nice. Raichu. Raichu, Raichu. Very nice. Let's see if it focuses the farther I get. Yeah, nice looking Raichu. So two hollow hits so far. Nothing worth the five, nothing worth the five bucks back, yeah. It's all, all fun and love. We are trying to get those hits, though. Let me go ahead and open all these packs now to make it a little bit easier to just rip them. You know what I mean? Let's rip straight through them. That way we're not, you know, because the last video was about 20-something minutes long. But, hey, can't go wrong. And one thing about this set, too, is the cards are so horribly printed they're so they're printed so bad in this set it's extremely disgusting how these cards are cut they're cut horribly like i've pulled so many off-centered cards from this from this set that it, it, it makes you cringe i pulled the charizard that was like that much off-centered it was disgusting all right so let's see how many packs we got we got one two three four five six packs let's see the pack arts tapu all right, got a lot of a uh, lot of uh, ho oh so we're gonna go over there to the ho oh side. Yeah, we will be trying to bring this content to you guys as much as possible, and uh, you know, hopefully, you guys do enjoy it. I don't give away code cards because I am stingy, 
so I'm so sorry. We might do a code card giveaway eventually. Ooh, fire from a whole pack. Is that going to be some fire? Some fire. Whoa, nothing but fire. Another Charmeleon. This is going to be a fire pack. I have a feeling because it's fire on fire. Rattata right and a. Ooh, an Acerola Full Arts. Acerola Full Art. But, like, you can tell, like, the whiting on these packs are like, what the hell? It's like, what what the hell? But it's actually a uh, pretty good centering. Just a little bit of damage on the back. But Ace of Roller Full Art, I'm going to take it. I think that's the first Full Art card we got. And we bought about 43, 43 or 46 packs, uh, loose packs of these. So, I mean, I me personally, I prefer the, um, the booster boxes because you're guaranteed. With this, you're not guaranteed. It's, it's pretty much based on luck with this set. Let's uh, let's say water energy. We're pretty much based on luck with this set. With with a booster box, you're guaranteed to get what you you know some hits. Uh, that's the first hit I've got. Probably opened up about. Ooh, I think I see something nice. Ooh, we got a Mars Shadow GX. Nice. As I'm speaking bad about the pull rates, we get a back to back pull art. Back to back. Oh, that's not a full art actually. Mars Shadow GX with those Thunder Punches with the Shadow Hunt to move. Ladies and gentlemen, it's turning around for us. Will we get a third hit in a row? Probably not. Probably not. Let's call a Fire Energy. I'm going to say Fire Energy. Water Energy. Shout out to my boy. I need to see if I had an editor. Every time I got a Water Energy, it would pop up on the screen. Shout out to my boy David at Premier Pools. Water Energy, Metapod, Lana, NK, Ralts, Crebrawler, Sneasel, Venipede, Hootoot, and another Marchamp GX. What did they, what are they doing? It's another hit, guys. That's actually three hits back to back from this set, which is not bad. Hopefully it doesn't cool down. But that is a nice hit, another Machamp GX. Nice looking card. Even got that little blue ring going through it. Very, very nice card, Marchamp GX. We pulled this yesterday. Pulled that yesterday. All right, so we got four packs left of the burning of the Chateaus. Hopefully, we get some more hits. Hey, I'll take more hits all day. I mean, I'm not complaining about getting hits. I just want a Rainbow Rare. Like, I, I'm I'm itchy, really itchy to pull a Rainbow Rare. Uh, I couldn't tell you the last time I pulled a Rainbow Rare card. Well, it was probably the Birds and, and Hidden Fates. The damn legendary Birds that everybody gets. That's probably the last one that I, I've gotten was the Rainbow Rare Birds that I could think of off the top of my head. Fairy Energy. Weakness Policy. Very playable. Good card. Heat more. Pikachu. Also, guys, we will be bringing you guys some good content with the new set, Darkness Ablaze. Ooh, a Lycanroc. Holographic. That's a hit. Uh, we will be bringing you guys some amazing content with the new set coming out, Darkness Ablaze. Do be prepared for that. We uh, won't obviously be able to get anything released early. Um, but in the future, we will be ha having these booster boxes and stuff released pretty early. So do be keeping a lookout for that as well as we will be having stuff that you guys will be able to order directly from our website and from us. So that you guys can get the most out of your experience. And all these cards that you see here being pulled, you guys can purchase as well. So that's something that... Ooh, another... Damn, we've hit five packs in a row. We've hit, yeah, about five packs in a row, guys. Not complaining. Wish it was a little, you know, something else, but I'm not complaining. Guys, I am going to go ahead and put my call in and say that this is the pack where we're going to get something good, guys. We're getting something good from this pack right here. I think a hyper rare or something. I don't know. I'm feeling hyper rare -y. But this is my call of the whole take, guys. I'm calling it now. I am calling it now. This is the call pan, sir. And a Dusk Nor. Still a hit. Holographic hit. Not, you know, I mean, it's a call, but, you know, I did call it. We're going to get something. We did get something, just not, uh, you know, the meatloaf I wanted. And I am recycling the meatloaf for it. It's not something I created. So here we go. Last pack of this. We still have more Burning Shadows. We will open up some more in the future videos to come. But, uh, you know, we, we are going to try to see if we can get some Fuego guys for you. Some Fuego. Right on. Lunatone, Seedra, Ryolu, Qfly, Tynamo, Dustno, Inke. Gloom and a burnt fish. Brewish. So the pulls stopped. Five hits in a row, though. I'm not complaining. We got the Acerola, 
two GXs and then two holographics. Guys, for the time, here we go. Charizard GX Elite. Uh, well, not Elite, but the 10. We need to pull this Charizard card again. I see, I know a guy who's pulled literally like five or six Charizards. Uh, I don't know. He's opened up quite a bit of packs. Um, I know I'm up there and opening up packs as well. Ooh, two Charizards. So we'll go Charizard, Zapdos, Charizard, Zapdos. We'll do that. Um, he's pulled freaking two Charizard, like more than two, like fucking a lot of Charizards, which is crazy, which is really crazy. And I just cursed, which I never do on my videos. So please see if I had an editor, I would just be able to beep that part out. Now, wouldn't I? All right, guys, here we go. Fairy Energy, Misty Determination, Pokemon Center Lady, Metapod, Charmander, Cliff Fairy, Psyduck. Shout out my boys, David at Premier Pools. Star you damn a lot of water. Ooh, and a Rowlet. So that means I have the whole set. Dissect you die. Um I can't think of the other one. And a butterfree. I can't think of the other one that, that the uh, second stage uh for right now. Dactrix. I think it's Dactrix. So we got a hit there. Nice little hit from the fates of the Hitten. We'll go Zapdos. I know the funny thing is I don't even remember the pack that I pulled, the hyper rare Zard. Or not the hyper rare Zard, the um Whatchamacallit, the uh, the uh, Shiny Charizard. I don't remember what pack it was. An electric Energy, Scyther, shout out to DJ. She needs to bring her suggestion. Guys, if you have any Pokemon that is like your Pokemon or Energy that's your Pokemon, let me know. I'll give you a shout out in the video. No problem. Clefairy, Psyduck, Magikarp, Staryu. Oh my god, I've been on a Guzma pull spree, guys. Oh my god, we pulled this Guzma yesterday. <laughs> I've legit been on a Guzma pulling street. Nice. Guzma came out to play. Not a bad card. It's worth about 30 bucks now. It's worth about $30. So it's a very decent, decent card. Nice pull. I'm not going to complain. Not the Charizard or the Sylveon or one of the gold top of Lele cards. But I will take it. I think we, like, we need a couple gold cards. Cynthia Trainer card, full art. Still on the hunt for her, man. When is she going to come out and make her appearance? I've been waiting for her to make an appearance, but she just doesn't want to go. All right, let's go. Chorizo, as my boy Falcons Gaming calls him, Shiny Chorizo. Chorizo is a dark uh, hot dog type thing cooked in Spanish culture, which I don't like at all. It's disgusting. But, yep, here we go. One, two, three, four. But that's what he called. He called him Shiny Chorizo. So he pulled three, two out of... Out of uh, three packs. So here we go. Hopefully we get something here. Psyduck. Psyduck to you know who. Magikarp. Staryu. Slowpoke. Voltorb. And a Metapod and a Arbok. Nothing there. It's expected. Charizard packs don't give you heat. Even though they just gave me a Guzma. They don't give you heat. So here we go. Last pack. Momentum. That means we're we're getting some momentum from the last pack. You know what I mean? People are probably like, "Wait, it's not. That's not how it goes." Well, it's how I say it. Here we go. Four cards. Last pack momentum, guys. Are we gonna get a hit? I don't know. We shall see on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Koga's trap. Brock's grit. Psyduck. Shots. So you know who? Magikarp. Staryu. That was like in the in exact same order as the last pack. And a. Kangaskhan and a wiggly tough G X. So no Charizard in this box. Charizard, hello, my good friend. So let's go over the hits today. See what we got. See what we got. Even though you've been looking at them the whole time. All right, let's go over. We got some decent hits. Uh, you know, nothing, nothing. Uh, you know, make Mama proud. Except Guzma. Guzma might make Mama proud. Dustnor, Polo Sand. Lycan Rock, Cluffy, or uh, excuse me, Celebi, Raichu, Wigglytuff, which is really cute. I love Wigglytuff. Marshadow GX, Rowlet Shiny, Machamp, It's Your Boy Guzma, which is very nice, and a Acerola. There you guys go, guys. If you do enjoy this content, please listen. Make sure you hit that like, share the video, subscribe. I would love nothing more for than this community to continue to grow, and we all get involved in this, and we make this a very big community. We do have an amazing community so far, and I want to just say thank you to all the supporters. We're on the road to 10K. We struggled this month to get up 
to 10k we're up and down up and down up and down but it's okay i'm not worried about it we'll get there when we get there guys but i do appreciate all the love and support from every single one of you guys that keep the channel going keep the channel running who support anything i do which is amazing and i support your endeavors as well guys don't you ever forget that i am here for you the same way you're here for me guys until the next video charizard we're still coming we're still coming charizard we're still coming i'll catch you guys later peace